to the health beat now. We'll check back in on this coming up later. Letters are being sent home to parents about chicken pox, a local daycare and elementary school dealing with one or two cases, but a local pediatrician says it shouldn't be a problem at all. Our Jesslyn Adams researching this situation today, joining us now live with more. Jess, what's going on here? Ben, the problem is not the schools and daycares. These places are following protocol, requiring students have all their immunizations up to date and proof of that. The real question here is, why are the children coming down with the virus that's pretty much preventable? It itches, it burns, it's highly contagious, but there's a vaccine rendering chicken pox preventable. Vaccination is the cornerstone of, of medical care for children. Still, cases of the virus are being reported in elementary schools and daycares. The health department notified us last uh, two weeks ago about a child who had um, a positive diagnosis of chicken pox. A child too young for vaccination was exposed to the virus prior to her first day of daycare, cutting that trip short. The child had been in our center for one day. It was her first day, so naturally she did not come back. She still has not returned. In leaving the the school to follow health department protocol to successfully thwart an outbreak. More importantly, strict vaccination requirements could be what kept the virus from spreading through one daycare center. Immunization records are a blue card are extremely important. You can't come to our center without having been immunized unless there's, you know, a reason, a good reason at that. Dr. Ramsey with Dothan Pediatrics says if you are up to date on shots, there's only a three to five percent chance of you catching the chicken pox. It's so important for that child who has the disease that the children around them all are vaccinated to prevent that spread and prevent that likelihood. Because that quick shot will help your child and other children avoid getting sick. Now, the local daycare that I spoke with is happy to say this incident stayed isolated, only one person, and has been fully taken care of. But a lot of that, again, is credited to vaccines. Ben. All right, thanks a lot. We certainly appreciate that report, Jess. Vaccines out there, go get them, friends. The